हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल आज मैं जो आपके लिए टॉपिक लाया हूँ वो है टर्मिनोलॉजीज इन ब्रेक मेसनरीज और यू कैन से टेक्निकल टर्म्स इन ब्रेक मेसनरी देर आर फ्यू टर्म्स एज यू कैन सी अवर हेयर दीज आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर लर्निंग इंजीनियर्स और प्रैक्टिसिंग इंजीनियर्स विच कैन बी यूज वाइडली ओवर ऑल द वर्ल्ड आई विल एक्सप्लेन दीज टर्म्स वन बाय वन but before we start our today's topic if you are new to my channel you are requested to please subscribe it and press the bell icon to get video updates so let's start our today's topic first of all what is brick masonry the art of building structures using bricks and building materials like cement is called brick masonry brick masonry is actually the art of building structures or uh, if you are using bricks then it is called brick masonry and if you are using stones it can be called as stone masonry and similarly if you are using concrete blocks it will be called as block masonry or uh, it can also be defined as brick masonry is a structural technique in which the bricks are laid in a systematic pattern and the joints are filled with mortar to make a solid structure as you can see over here in this picture this is the solid structure with the combination of cement mortar and bricks when these things unite it forms a wall and the art of making this wall is called as brick masonry what are the standard dimension of bricks in british specification it recommends the length should be this in us specification it recommends minimum length equal to this and maximum lengths are shown over here as you can see over here in pakistan the standard size of a brick is 9 inches into 4.5 inches into 3 inches which is equal to length time width time depth in india it is 190 into 90 into 90 in millimeters and it is length times width times depth these are the standard dimensions which are in common practice in different states of the or different regions of the world now coming towards the technical terms related to brick masonry first one is masonry it is used for the work of a mason mason is a person who builds structures with construction materials and what are masonry units it is an artificially prepared regular shape block used in the masonry works for example brick in brick masonry stone block in stone masonry and concrete block in block masonry it's mean that masonry units whatever the unit are you are using if you are using bricks then it will be called as brick masonry if you are using stones it would be called as stone masonry and if you are using concrete blocks it will be called as and the unit of masonry is brick stone or it could be concrete blocks what are arises the edges found by the intersection of plane surfaces of a brick are called as arises as you can see over here the edges of the bricks are called as arises what is frog the depression provided in the face of a brick during its manufacturing is called frog this depression shown in the figure is called as frog course each horizontal layer of a brick laid in a mortar is called course as you can see over here there are 1 2 3 4 5 courses of the brick what are quins the external corners of a wall are called quins and the bricks forming quins are called quin bricks for example quin header or quins stretcher this is the quin stretcher what is stretcher we will discuss it in next slide 
and this is the quin header perpends the imaginary vertical lines which includes vertical joints are called perpends they should be plumb as you can see over here in this picture the joint formed between two brakes with the help of motor and they are in vertical directions such type of joints are called as perpends what is header brick led with its width in elevation is called header in a course in which all bricks are header is called heading or header course the other one is stretcher brick led with its length in elevation is called stretcher in a course in which all bricks are stretcher is called stretcher or stretching course this is the stretcher in which brick is led along its length whereas in header brick is led along its width what is coulier coulier bricks are prepared by cutting standard bricks across length or in different ways to fulfill the requirements of bond in straight walls corners junctions or crosses is called coulayers they are of following types first one is queen coulayer and second one is king coulayer third one is beveled coulayer as you can see over here in in queen coulayer the the length of a brick is cut into two and coulayers are made along the length as you can see over here king coulier the one edge of a brick is broken according to the use or according to the requirement of the wall this is the example of beveled coulier what are brick beds brick beds are prepared by cutting standard bricks across width there are four types first one is three quarter bed half or square quarter bed third one is quarter bed and fourth one is beveled bed the examples are over here beveled bed and in beds bricks are cut along width as you can see over here in these pictures three quarter bed and beveled bed the difference is very clear over here in coulayers bricks are prepared by cutting standard bricks across the length and brick beds bricks are cutting across the width i hope it's now clear to you what is coulier and brick beds facing the external face of a wall is called facing backing the unexposed or internal face of a wall is called backing and hurting is the interior portion between facing and backing as you can see over here if this is the backing and this is the facing side of the wall then the area between the backing and facing is called as hurting bond in brick masonry it is the arrangement of bricks in each layer to avoid the continuity of vertical joints in any two adjacent courses the detailed explanation of bonds will be discussed in my upcoming video so that's why you are requested to please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get video updates last but not least coping it is provided at the top of the wall to avoid dampness as you can see over here in this picture number 2 is showing coping it is provided to avoid the penetration of moisture into the wall that's all for today for more videos you are again requested subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get video updates